thinking about how I'm about to graduate as a Division One athlete is something really special to me because it was always a dream and a goal of mine growing up to play Division One, but let alone graduate and play in all four years. When I first started out running track in seventh grade, I would, did not know how to work hard or what work ethic even meant, and that has completely transformed how I do everything in my life, from academics to community service, all around um, track has formed who I am today. I think about how hard I've worked to get to this place um, and how much dedication um, not only I have put into this, but my coaches and my teammates. In my four years here, we've, made, we've won a lot of games. We've beaten some great teams. We were one shot away from an NCAA tournament, and you know, I'll never forget those moments. Everything I did when I was little was revolved around baseball, growing up, and everything I worked for in high school, junior college to this point, it's all shaped my life into the person I am today. Takes a puck at the blue line, sweeps it to the right, here's a wrister deflected, great save, rebound, they score! Messner sprawled along the ice, put it through the pads of Monroe anyway. If you'd looked at this apartment four years ago in my freshman year and seen the facilities, seen the, the support systems, and looked at them now at this year, you would notice a radical growth. Every year they're adding new things as far as nutrition, new strength coaches, Baxter Arena opened, and I know they got more in the pipeline. Honestly, I think that we could be nationally ranked in each sport, both men's and women's, and honestly, I expect that to happen in the next two to three years. All the athletes here are doing something right. We're taking huge steps, and I'm so excited to see that grow. You will see uh, in the next coming years that all these teams are going to make breakthroughs, and they're all going to get to the NCAA tournament. And it's going to be, you know, it's going to be a staple program for for years to come. Here comes Emmanuel Hamza. It's over. The Mavericks are seven league tournament champions for the first time. Here's Caniglia, big swing. That's a home run. Adam Caniglia. The athletic community in Omaha is like a family. We always support each other 100%. We view everyone here as one whole team, and like we're all supporting each other and supporting each other's success. Cheering each other on when we're working out in the gym. We're always saying good job to other sports. This is a family. It's not just individual team sport, um, we are S1 and we are UNO Athletics. Will lob it all the way down the floor. Wofford Humphrey goes up to catch it, Look, kicks it to Nora. Three on the way! Oh! Daniel Nora baking a three! We're going to a second overtime! Here's Omaha with the set. Horky, successful. It's been nothing but amazing to get to play every weekend in front of uh, you know the fans of Omaha. Um, the support behind uh, the hockey program and the whole athletic department is just second to none, I think, across the country. More and more people are coming to games. More and more people are having a presence on social media, openly supporting us. Every single year, it has increased, and it's been amazing. I've never really had so many people reach out to me and say, hey, like congratulations, uh, what you guys are doing are awesome. We've been following you things like that and you know and you know you get six, seven, eight, nine, ten of those messages and you're just like wow like we're actually doing something important in this community and people are recognizing it. Nice cut down the wing, lays it into the middle. Suarez fumbles it. Romero has a shot and it's in for the Mavericks. Emily Romero gets a brace for the game winner and that will do it at Caniglia for the golden goal. Skips it under the rim to Eckleberry who returns it to Walter who scores plus a foul. The coaching staff has done a lot to kind of mature you and you know get get you ready for the real world really kind of not only making you a better hockey player through the four years but getting you ready for life i think i'm a way better player and possibly a person baseball come and goes but those people you meet they mean a lot a lot to me and i'll cherish those relationships forever i am very fortunate that i've been able to be a part of the growth of this program but I think within the next 10 years, it's going to be something that all of us will be able to look back on and say we were there when it started.